श्री कृष्णा श्री कृष्णा श्री कृष्णा श्री कृष्णा गुरुर्ब्रह्मा गुरुर्विष्णु गुरुर्देव महेश्वर गुरु साक्षात परम ब्रह्म तस्म श्री गुरव नम तस्म श्री गुरव नम फिफ्थ मंत्र न चोर्ध्व न चादो न चातर न बाह्यम न मध्यम न तीर्य न पूर्वापराधिक वियद्व्यापक अखंडक तदेको वशिष्ट शिव केवलोहम we have to cross the three barriers one barrier is the world and it is crossed by practicing space space so the practice of space is worldly things will not have any impact on us or will have minimum impact meaning presence or absence of things in this world <clears throat> will not be an issue of our life see small little things are enough to upset us i wanted to buy you know that i won but you know, you know, you know, everybody has got i won and after you get that phone new phone comes in the market the other day one uh, person asked me sami ji What is the reason I am not able to get married? I said, "You are not seen girl. I have seen, but that nothing is clicking." I said, "Do you know why? You are like a person who wants to buy phone, but then you think maybe some new model will come. <laughs> so you are waiting for new model to come, and there is no end to it. Therefore, practicing." space as the spiritual practice this is the simple thing don't get lost in possession of the things then gross space gross world now we go to the next space that is the mind space now in mind space what are the contents the thoughts are the contents so like the gross space is not affected by the gross contents the mind space is also not affected by the thought contents see yes observe and i tell you the whole world is so beautiful you can never get bored <clears throat> suppose i tell you one joke first time you hear that you will laugh again i tell you the same joke you will feel pity we know it 
again i repeat and tell the same joke 10 times you will get bored is it not but you take the other way around you go on repeating your miseries you don't get bored telling the same thing again and again see friends because we are giving undue importance to the thoughts in life and for that we must know what is the anatomy of thought in the womb of the thought is the object of importance importance is given by us nobody gives importance for us some people like red color some like blue some like yellow 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 dirty fellow i don't like so what is the logic see and therefore whatever things we like or we dislike they enter our mind and when a foreign body enters there is reaction of the mind tissue and the reaction is called as a thought and wherever there is a abscess or something we get hurt we are uncomfortable or attempt is to remove that so we know only one way fulfill our desires but instead of that you take the other uh, path it is we who have given importance to anything so nobody can devalue it for us and this liking and disliking has zero logic you must be knowing the story of majnu and laila you may not be knowing of ram and sita <laughs> majnu and laila it is said laila was very ugly to look at majnu was very handsome and when there was no possibility of their separation so majnu's uh, this laila's father spoke to majnu and said yaar you are so handsome so nice why are you running after my girl she is ugly i can't won't call her average she is ugly why are you running find out some beautiful for you you will get plenty of them then majnu uacha what will majnu what did majnu say to see the beauty of laila you require the eyes of majnu and 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 friends that is why that day i told you the beauty is what is that in the hands of the dear older see she remembers <laughs> so something is beautiful something is ugly something is nice something is not nice it has no logic no reason see therefore if we have given value importance to something devalue that this is what happens i love him i love her then we fall in love and get hurt then hurting is called as marriage and after some time they realize their mistake they correct their mistake separation so earlier i like now i don't like and both of them have no value and both of them create thoughts therefore if we want to practice mind space earlier what we practice gross space now practice mind space so what will be that practice do not give any too much of value to your personal likes and dislikes when we do not give much value for that what happens living at zero complaint level no complaints see friends slowly 
the mind will start remaining undisturbed. Undisturbed mind is abode of the divine, nay, undisturbed mind is Paramatma. How simple it is. And what we suffer maximum? Not because of others. Suppose I suffer because of you. I will go to my room. But if I am suffering because of my own mind, so jau, so jau, kaha? Where do I go? Then I open the bottles and start liquid spirituality. And what is for? Only for controlling the mind. When then it becomes addiction. See, friends, Therefore, the problem of minds can be sorted out not by medication, but only by right understanding. That's all. See, friends, the other day in Jaipur, after my lectures were over on the last day, Namaskar, Chamatkar, Prashad, everything, the one person, elderly man, must be around uh, mid-50s or early 60s, he came and he held my feet and started crying. I said, come on, here, enough. I am getting tickling. Then he got up. He said, Swamiji, you have saved my life. I said, I am so sorry. <laughs> he said, what makes you so relaxed, Swamiji? I said, manufacturer's defect. I don't know. He said, the other day, I came out of the house to commit suicide. It was finalized. Enough. I can't take anything anymore. And when I came out to commit suicide, I happened to see your poster somewhere. That your talks are there. When I looked at your picture, I thought, let me give him a chance. <laughs> so he gave me a chance. And he attended all the seven days talks. And he said, now I know what was the problem. See, all problems are because of wrong thinking. Wrong thinking begins because we are not living the right kind of life. We have notional life. See, our notions are about ourselves. I do good to everybody, but nobody likes me. It cannot be. See, we must be getting involved in somebody's life. They don't want, don't keep away. That's it. But we don't understand that. that we are unwanted. The other day somebody told me, Swamiji, um, you should come and stay here for a longer period. I said, do you know why people come and talk to me? Because they know tomorrow I'm going. If I come and stay over here, then Samiji, please uh, don't mind. From tomorrow, don't come. <laughs> <laughs> we have prayers for son because he comes and goes. Do we have prayer for the space? Because all the time available. So, do not get disturbed by any thought only through wisdom. And this wisdom you can learn from your own experiences. One husband came and was talking to me. Swamiji, don't make fun of me, uh, but I am fed up of my wife. What should I do? I say, come on, this a divorce. You will get another one. No, I can't. Why? She is earning. <laughs> Then what should I do? I said, if you can't do that, my next option is think properly. So what is there to think? I said, you know, answer my question. I don't like argument. Okay. Husband is a common noun or a proper noun? Husband is a proper noun or common? Common noun. Any dumb getting married to any dumb bee is a husband. See? And every husband is miserable. So if you are miserable, what is the novelty? If you are happy, then there is something wrong. Oh, every husband is miserable? Yes. 
then it's okay. <laughs> Look at the world with this eye of wisdom. You can never be miserable in life. See? All the time, seriously. So, we have uh, trans, um, transcended the grass space and the mind space. In the third, Chidakash. Chidakash is where somebody is born. Gross place, gross world for the mind. Mind is for somebody. Mind itself is not disturbed. I am disturbed. I want this. I don't like this. Mind has no problem. When good thoughts come, they come in the same mind. Bad thoughts come, they come in the same mind. Inspiration comes in the same mind. Perspiration comes in the same mind. Then, mind is not disturbed by the thoughts. Somebody is disturbed. Now, we have to get rid of this somebody. And he is seated in the Chida Akasha, the conscious space. So, got these three points clear? Gross world, gross space. Hot world, mind space. Now, this somebody world. So, whenever we are disturbed, there is somebody at the root of every disturbance. When you are sitting for meditation, we only complain about the thoughts. That whenever I sit for meditation, too many thoughts come, what should I do? Don't sit for meditation. No, but my guru told me to sit for, then sit for meditation. But too many thoughts come, then don't sit for meditation. See, we become the mobile complaint boxes. On the contrary, learn how to uh, merge this body into nobody. And this technique I told you, nothing new. Experience without experiencer. That's it. See the three conditions I told you. The uh, uh, Manda Jnani, he knows everything, but he can't practice anything. Then he suffers. Then Madhyam Jnani, he, he is not at all aware of what is happening. See? Like an intoxicated person. And Uttama Jnani, he is just average, so simple, nobody will even recognize his greatness. Because he is going through all the experiences, but not becoming an experiencer. This is the entry in the Chidakash. This is this. See, friends, it's not difficult, it's very simple. So, Vyad Vyapakatvat Akhandai Karupaha. So, the whole thing is the story of the space. Tasmat Atmanaha Akasha Sambhutaha Akasha Dvayu Vayor Agni Agner Apaha. Adhya Prathvi, Prathvivya, Oshadhaya, Oshadibya, Annam, Annat Purushaha, and it will come down. So, discard the Annamaya Kosh, then Pranamaya Kosh, Manomaya Kosh, Vidnyanamaya Kosh, and transcend the Anandamaya Kosh. Hear everything, see everything, but no comment. Why? The hearer or seer is not born.
देखो संतो तो तदे को अवशिष्ट शिव केवलोहम तो लाइक द स्पेस सपोर्ट्स एवरीथिंग गुरा स्पेस सपोर्ट द डायरेक्शन एंड द कंटेंट बट स्पेस हैज नैदर डायरेक्शन नॉर कंटेंट द माइंड सपोर्ट्स ऑल गुड एंड बैड थॉट्स बट द माइंड इज बियॉन्ड गुड एंड बैड द चिदाकाश सपोर्ट्स ऑल द बडीज मिजरेबल बडी हैप्पी बडी कन्फ्यूज बडी क्लियर बडी बट इन फैक्ट he is not conditioned by anything therefore this is one of the practice try experiencer without experience without experience now we go to the next shlok न शुक्ल न कृष्ण न रक्त न पीत न कुड्यम न पीनम न ह्रस्व न दीर्घम अरूपम तथा ज्योतिराकार तदेको वशिष्ट शिव केवलोहम न शुक्ल न कृष्ण न रक्त दीज आर द डिफरेंट कलर्स द शुक्ल इज फ्रे फेयर कृष्ण इज डार्क रक्तम इज रेड पीतम इज यलो कुड्यम इज थीन बोनी पीनम इज नो शार्प कॉर्नर्स ह्रस्व नॉट टॉल दीर्घम नॉट शॉर्ट न रसम न दीर्घम नाइदर इट इज शॉर्ट नॉर इट इज टॉल मीनिंग दिस इज द डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ द फॉर्म्स सो द शुक्ल इज द सत्व गुणा कृष्ण इज द तमो गुणा एंड रक्तम इज द रजो गुणा the one who is which is beyond the impact of the three gunas meaning none of the worldly things good bad or worse doesn't matter anything here we all have to caution ourselves we must not carry this comparative attitude when we move in the world what will be the comparison we try to prove ourselves to be superior and better than others we are not like others eating non vegetarian so who asked you nobody asked don't worry in one bengali house i went for diksha so that amma was coming regularly for satsang so she said ji you sit here i'll get food so she got vegetarian food then her son came he also came sat next to me with the chicken and fish or whatever so mother became very angry you i told you don't come here now sam ji vegetarian wow 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 i said mama shant i have no objection let him eat unless he plucks my finger and eats it doesn't matter we friends we have to learn that every odd experience of our life is a spiritual examination then you can never become frustrated in life so na shuklam na krishnam na raktam न पीतम ऑल कलर्स गॉन न कुंजम न पीनम न इधर थिन नॉर फैट न ह्रस्व न दीर्घम न इधर शॉर्ट नॉर टॉल देर फोर अरूपम फॉर्मलेस 
Now, <clears throat> like we told you about the sound. First, don't talk to yourself, don't produce sound. Before you talk to others, ask yourself, is it necessary to talk? That means don't produce sound. Third, listen to silence, meaning don't get disturbed by any sound. This is that. What efforts you have put? Wherever there are efforts, we are not normal. Pratna Shaitilya Ananta Samapati Vyam. This is with reference to the sound. Nama Rupa Jagat. So, Nama we have taken care of. Rupa. The truth is, I am neither white nor black nor red nor yellow. These are the four types of people in this world. White we know, black we know, red Indians that we know, and yellow Chinese that we know. One of my friends, he, he married a Chinese lady. And uh, what a very good she was. But what can you do? Death has come, so she died. And he was so disturbed and so frustrated. Every time he said, Swamiji, you have to convince me why she died. She was so good. We had no problem. Why she died suddenly? <clears throat> Once, twice, thrice, I tried to console him. But as if, you know, I killed her. <laughs> then I thought, no, I must protect myself. <laughs> then I said, you know, Chinese product, don't stay longer. <laughs> so, white, black, red, yellow, don't have to give too much choice to colors. Then, similarly, thin, fat. How much time we spend in our life only for maintaining the figure? Figure ki figure chodo. Once I happened to go to a cremation ground. Not for my purpose. <laughs> Somebody died, so as a one of the formality, I had to go. So I went there. And there, uh, that body was on the fire and burning. And like everybody, I was standing there quiet. So one person came and asked, Swami, how much time it will take? <laughs> I said, I had no experience. <laughs> You can laugh. I was crying that time. <laughs> yeah. Then I said, I don't know. He said, I can tell you. <laughs> I said, okay, tell. He said, it will take about one hour, 15, 20 minutes. I said, very good. Do you know how I know? I said, I don't know. I don't want to know. <laughs> this is my sadhana. I don't want to know anything about anybody. What is there to know? You have to know yourself, that's enough. So he said, I'll tell you. I said, okay, tell. Those who are fat, they burn early. And they require less fuel. <laughs> because they have built in. <laughs> and those who are bony, bony, they require lot and lot of jaltai <laughs> Therefore, die fat. <laughs> so that after death, no problem. 
न कुंजम न पीनम न रसम न दीर्घम देन अरूपम सो डिस्कार्ड एनी इंपॉर्टेंस गिवन टू द फॉर्म एंड कलर जो है ठीक है इज ब्यूटिफुल वेरी नाइस वेन यू टेक दिस एटीट्यूड इन लाइफ नो कॉमेंट्स देखो फॉर्म्स सुनो साउंड्स मत बोलो नो कॉमेंट तो एक्सपीरियंस इज हैपनिंग बट एक्सपीरियंसर इज नॉट बॉर्न हाउ सिंपल इज द स्पिरिचुअल प्रैक्टिस we are not telling you take the mala in the hand and hari ram hari ram 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 hari hari krishna hari krishna hari ram hari ram 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 and if you are a gujarati jay shri krishna 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 jay sk jay sk jay sk abbreviation see friends therefore arupam so two techniques one listen to silence you have conquered 50% world second thing see the space when these two things you work on it you we'll see the difference the other day somebody asked me swami ji um, why don't you take us to um, badrinath kedarnath himalayas and uh, kailash and all that i said i don't like mountains then i like ocean why the reason is when you stand in front of a huge mountain kailash this is a shape a form you feel how insignificant i am on the contrary you stand in front of the ocean expands you dissolve in that pasand apni apni khayal apna apna see therefore arupam and once you take this then see i was sitting for meditation and then suddenly bhagwan krishna came but i was surprised why he came in jean see so arupam tatha jyotir aakar katvat therefore friends learn this simple thing light or jyoti has no form what you are seeing me is a reflected light between us there is light is it not but can we see that we can see only reflected light and if you want to see the original light what you have to do there are four fingers if you have to see the space between them what you have to do ignore the shape of the four fingers if you want to listen to silence ignore the sounds how do we ignore dekho suno mat bolo we don't have to close our eyes no need inside you will see when i close my eyes krishna came there also one thumb rule anything that comes and goes is a trick of the mind don't get carried away by that arupam tatha jyoti kar jyoti aakar katvan tadev ko vashishta shiva kevalo ham this is my essential nature na shuklam therefore yesterday i told you one technique sit in your room complete darkness open your eyes and whatever experience you have 
you cannot put it in words. Because eyes are open, therefore you are seeing. Eyes are seeing, you are seeing. Because of darkness, nothing can be seen. Because nothing can be seen, no seer is born. That is the truth. Seeing is happening, but seer is not born. Hearing is happening, but hearer is not born. This you don't have to do. Do it. You do it here only. Huh? <laughs> this is not heard. So you have the ability to invoke it. So, arupam tatha jyotika jyotira karata katvan tadeka vishishtaha shiva kevaloham. Next mantra. Na shastha, na shastram, na shishyo, na shiksha. Na chatvam, na chaham, na chayam, prapanchaha. Sarupa va bodho vikalpa sahishnuho. Tadeko vashishta shiva kevaloham. Na Shasta, the ruler, the king, government, Na Shasta, Na Shastram, there is no Indian penal code. Do this, do that. Na Shasta, neither the controller nor the controlling rules and regulations. Na Shishaha, no disciple. Na shiksha, nothing is taught. Na chatvam, neither you. Na cha aham, nor I. Na chayam, no tea. <laughs> See? If you want to realize, don't take tea. Bhagavan Shankaracharya must not have taken tea, therefore he doesn't know that. We are followers of Bhagavan Sri Krishna. See in the 15th chapter of Gita, the mantra is Sarvasya Chaham Rudhisanya Vishtaha Mattaha Smriti Jnana Mapohanancha. So in some of my talk I mentioned, see Bhagavan Krishna said, Sarvasya Chaham, Sapko Chaya Chilakti. Chaha means Chaya. There was one Gambirananda only sitting. He said, Swamiji, how can you say Bhagavan Sri Krishna and tea? That time there was no tea. I said, you were there. He said, no, I was not there. I said, I was there. <laughs> so can you challenge that? How? I said, tell me, how many wives Bhagavan Krishna had? 16,108. Do you know? 16,100 were from where? Prag Jyotishpur. Prag Jyotishpur means Gauhati. Gauhati means Assam. Assam is Assam tea. <laughs> he whose so many wives are from the tea garden. Do you think he will remain without tea? On the contrary, he may be given bath in the tea. Okay. So, Shasta, Shastra, Shishya, Shiksha, I, you, uh, and this world, nothing is there. Now this, now to uh, try to establish in yourself only by analyzing your experiences. What are our experiences? They are conditioned by three factors, time, space and object. Where are we? We are in Melbourne. When are we? 2024. What are we, man, woman, young, old, rich, poor, educated, illiterate? And when you go to sleep, don't demonstrate. When you go to sleep, where are you? When are you? And what are you? But you are still there.
But we get so much lost in all these things. Therefore, the real spiritual practice is don't get lost in all these things in life. Therefore, never get lost wherever there is argument. One example I tell you, this happened in Guwahati because the topic has come, I remember. I was staying with a Jain family. Very nice people. And they had one calendar where there was a Jain Sadhvi. Her picture was there. I said, Mama, she is so cute, so sweet she is. What's her name? So she told me some name. So Swamiji, uh, she is here only. Will you like to take her darshan? I said, yes, I like to take. So we went. So when I went, I did namaskar to her. Said, no, 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 namaskar. You come and sit here. And she told all the people who were sitting with her. Now you go. Now I will have Shastrartha with Swamiji. I said, Amma, I am Agyana Shiromani. I know nothing. No, no, we must discuss. I said, I don't know how can you discuss. Then I said, I agree to whatever you say. Over. Remember this. Vado na avalambyaha. Never get lost in discussion, argument. We don't have to prove anything to anybody. What is told in our scriptures is not a political tool. Like the discoveries of science. Are they meant for a people in a geographic area for a particular historical time? Think. When we talk about, let us take the law of gravity. So is it meant only for the Britishers? Is it only applicable only in UK? Not outside? No. Universal. All the things are same. One youngster asked me this question. Swamiji, today we are in the modern world. The morning news becomes stale by afternoon. And your Bhagavad Gita is more than 5000 years old. How it can be applied? I said, don't apply. Or I said, no, I want to know why it is. I said, I have got only one way. Think properly. What is there to think? You see, during Bhagavad Gita time, 5000 years before or whatever may be the time, that time people were, you know, people were eating by the eyes. And they were hearing by the nose. And they used to have confusion in their stomach. Why are you telling like this thing? I said, because things have changed. No, you are pulling my leg. I said, Maharaj, Gita is not addressed to a people limited in a geographical area at a particular time of life. It is the universal declaration. Whether you accept or you don't accept. Therefore, there is no threatening on the contrary, Bhagavan says, those who do not have faith and do not accept, don't tell them. See, there is no place for propagation of Bhagavad Gita. Many people ask me, Swamiji, why don't you take propagating Bhagavad Gita? I say, look, I am not Bhagavad Gita. Why should I do? Is the one I want to Are we protecting Gita? Our Gita is protecting us. Work on yourself. See, friends. Therefore, na shastha, na shastram. Don't get lost. Advaita, Advaita, Vishishra, Advaita. Hinduism, Christianity, Jainism, then Buddhism, Islam. Don't get lost. Suppose I have to get my heart operated. 
suppose. But one Amma has cursed me. You will never get heart attack. I say, thank you for the curse. You don't feel bad about it. Say, why? You should at least ask why I said like that. I say, okay, tell why. You have no heart. <laughs> so how can you get heart attack? See, friends. Life is very simple, friends. Take life lightly in the light of wisdom. If you can mind your mind, everything is right. Therefore, Shastra, Shastra, don't get lost. You don't have to prove anything to anybody. Suppose somebody says, you are dumb. Don't underestimate me. You don't know. I am from Maharashtra. Mahadam. See, friends. So, na shasta, na shastram, na shishyaha. This is most important. There were two disciples for a guru. Poor guru. And they were doing the seva of the guru. In the afternoon, Guru Maharaj always sleeps. The two disciples, they have uh, taken their leg. This is my leg, this is your leg. And pressing the legs of the Guru. And Guru is sleeping. One day, right leg Guru, has, uh, the disciple has gone from there. Left leg disciple, I will not, that is not my leg. <laughs> and then, Guru Maharaj, because there was no pressure on that, he turned on his left side. So, right leg came and landed on the left he, you come on my leg. He took a danta and hit. <laughs> Protect yourself from disciples. <laughs> that is the reason I don't have a single disciple in the world. Hey. Never, never forget we are here throughout our life only as the seekers of truth. This principle I have learned from Bhagwan Ram Krishna Paramahamsa. He mentioned in one of his things, remain as a seeker of truth throughout life. The moment you take the position of a guru, whether others are benefited or not, you are definitely guaranteed destroyed. Therefore, na shastha, na shastram, na shishyaha, na shiksha, do not try to teach anybody anything. Why? God failed. Do you think we will succeed? This is one of the most important principles on the spiritual path. Nobody can teach anything to anybody. We have to learn and every experience of our life is our Guru. And if we cannot learn from our own experience, even Sakshat Brahmaji comes and tells with his four heads, even then he will fail. Because we are not ready to learn. Not only ready, we are not able to learn. See? Swamiji, uh, should somebody uh, jump into the water if he doesn't know swimming? No, he should not. But unless he jumps into the water, can he learn swimming? No, he cannot learn. Then what should you do? You should write a thesis on swimming and get PhD. No, 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 tell what should. Then jump into the water with a teacher who can teach you. Tad vidyanatham guru meva vigachet tamit panhi shrotriyam brahmanishtam. Then who is our guru? Everything and being is our guru if we are able to learn from everything and being. It is so simple, friends. Therefore, na shastha, na shastram, na shisho, 
न शिक्षा वी डोंट हैव टू टीच एनीबडी एवरीबडी इज परफेक्ट इन देयर ओन प्लेस न चत्वम न चाहम न अयम प्रपंचः सिमिलरली आई वर्सेस यू यू वर्सेस आई कांस्टेंट इन द सेम थिंग वन गर्ल रोट मी वन हिंदी पोएम आफ्टर मैरिज आफ्टर अबाउट अ ईयर और सो स्वामी जी शादी के पहले मैं ही मैं मैं ही मैं मैं ही मैं शादी के बाद कुछ दिन के लिए तू ही तू तू ही तू तू ही तू बट नाउ तू तू मैं मैं तू तू मैं 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 तू 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 मैं मैं एंड वी आर फ्रॉम गुजरात देर फोर हूँ तू 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 हूँ तू 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 हो दिस आई वर्सेस यू शुड नॉट बी प्रमोटेड इन लाइफ less of i and more of we the whole attitude changes i have done that i have done that ah what did they call in today's language team work okay. therefore na chatvam na chaham na cha ayam prapanchah similarly don't get carried away and too much involved in this world. अपनी अवकात पहचानो फाइंड आउट टू वॉट एक्सटेंड यू कैन परफॉर्म और डू योर जॉब डू दैट डोंट गो बियॉन्ड इट अवर गोल शुड नॉट बी फॉर गॉड एंड वॉट इज अवर गोल वी शुड बी सच ए फिट इंस्ट्रूमेंट दैट द डिवाइन विल चूज अस फ्रेंड्स डोंट सी गॉड let him seek us and why and how he will seek us because he wants to do something but he has got limitation god has limitation yes apani pado he doesn't have hands he wants to do something what to do what to do what to do so he is searching for the free hands our hands are busy in selfish activities destroying others how can he function through our hands he doesn't have the tongue he wants to say something but our tongue is busy in self glorification and condemning others not free he doesn't have mind he want to think but our mind is occupied paraninda or negativities so what should be the spiritual practice empty yourself to such an extent that he will fill us empty thyself i shall feel thee empty yourself see friends and this is what we do i am not telling you something which you do not know this is what we do how when you go to sleep what we are doing emptying to such an extent that in sleep we are nobody now what is happening we are carrying the burden we become so many bodies see and because of this we cannot stop talking to ourselves my friends this thing which i have repeatedly telling is the most highest spiritual practice stop talking to yourself fir kis ke sath baat karu zarurat nahi no need try when there is a need you talk and there is no need don't talk because mauna is the discipline of mind it is not the discipline of speech so if we have to control the mind see in bhagavad gita bhagwan sri krishna says mana prasada saubhyatvam maunam atma vinigraha so the discipline of the mind is mana prasada you are ever cheerful and happy saumyatvam you are soft not too much agitated 
then maunam maunam means you do not talk to yourself for this sadhana you don't require anything wherever you are i have given a name to this this is my special yoga don't talk to yourself how this name came somebody somebody what you are telling this don't talk what is the name of this yoga i said i have given this name as kamod yoga kamod yoga yes how come when you go and land on the kamod till the job is done don't talk to yourself give it a try not here <laughs> friends simply we sit and keep on <laughs> you know this i learned when i keep on moving around the world on airport normally i am alone so if you this is my very nice time pass so you sit down comfortably and why the people what they are doing constantly talking to themselves see give it a try start with 1 minute right now so it is possible we don't require any particular asan we don't require any particular place i want to sit before bhagwan krishna and keep quiet but they say uh, we should chant bhagwan's name but now i have to keep quiet so what i can i will chant one mantra and then आज को 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 चुप रहो ना यार एंड टू मेक इट मोर इंटेंस विदाउट एनी स्ट्रगल और प्रेशर ऑन योर हेड लिसन टू साइलेंस देन व्हेन यू आर सिटिंग क्वाइट यू आर क्वाइट द वर्ल्ड विल नॉट बी क्वाइट everything will keep on happening in the world and because you are quiet you will get disturbed very easily dekhte nahi meditation kar raha hu don't disturb see if you are listening to silence world is not world is producing sound so add one more parameter don't talk to yourself and listen to silence listening to silence is not reacting to any sound the world is created from the sound the tanmatra of the space is the sound shabda the whole world is in the space akash if there is no space no 
forms possible. If there is no space, no shabdas possible, sound possible. Therefore, these two things, do not talk to yourself and listen to silence. So you are attacking the world from both the sides, from within and from without. And the world disappears. Na ayam prapanchaha. This world is nothing but this non-stop ka 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 Om Purnamadaha Purnamidam Purnat Purnamudachate Purnasya Purnamadaya Purnameva Vashishate Om Shanti 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 Hari Om Sri Guru Pyo Namaha Hari Om